everybody. It's Michelle Patterson here with Angel Souls and Star Daily Card reading for October 7th, 2021. Let's see what we have going on for today. Okay, it's time to release negativity. Full moon in Scorpio. So whatever negativity means for you. So that is, you know, I am scared. I live in fear. I live defensively. Um, I'm always conniving. I'm always trying to figure out my next move. I got to know what what is going to happen or I don't feel right about my life, right? Um, or are you controlling your loved ones? Some of you are so afraid of not having a love partner, as I've been saying, that you might become extra controlling of your partner. I'm feeling the message of some parents out there who maybe end up not um, not letting their kids go. Like when they, when they grow up, <laughs> it's time for them to move on. Maybe you hang on to them. So this negativity is not getting sucked into stories. Again, it's not like you stand back and pretend like you're above it all. Um, you step up and you do what you can. But where are we pulling focus constantly, constantly, constantly? And also part of that negativity so we're talking about being self-centered and then there's this other side of it where where are we not giving people who are seeing truth we're not giving them a voice or we are pushing them away and saying you don't know and you know there's a lot of toxicity going on here we need to watch how we're being judgmental of others where do we shut people down if people are about to have a very important conversation that could crack an energy open and you're just trying to always look like the big person or the fair person, or you're just afraid of conflict, and you're just always trying to quiet everybody down. That's not fair, okay? We're in a time where we're processing this, and so it needs to be talked about. So look at your own life. Look at where you have negativity. Look at where you think people should, um, you know, kind of cater to you. I feel like that's a message where it's like, you know, I, I guess what I'm, this is how I want to put it. How can we better, how can we cooperate better? How can we better work with one another as opposed to seeing each other's competition, right? That's a given. Uh, or where can we be happier for people who have good things happening to them? I've seen that so often where someone's super jealous that someone got engaged. Why? If they found love and they're happy, why do you have an issue with that? It's not fair. Um, that's a red flag to me. That's a, that's, that might be a diagnosis or at least one piece of a diagnosis that you think that someone else's happiness means something against you. Uh, but those are things to look at and to be aware of, all right? So we're going to leave it there. I'm sending you all so much love and take care.